All right, back on the 90 XT, doing the oil filter. So the oil filter is on this model. 90 XT is a 2001. It is on the left side of the cab. There is your starter. And right behind the starter is your oil filter. Now, I've already used my oil wrench to loosen it. It wasn't that bad. So, finish taking it off. Now, of course, you're going upside down, so it's going to be reverse. So that's tightening it, and we'll have to go to the right to loosen it. And then we will get this off. The arm is stuck. There we go. And then. There you have it. That's the old filter. Let's sit this down. Now, grab a new filter. Now, what I'm going to do is with a new filter, I've got some hydraulic oil over here that came out. That's pretty clean. Uh, what I'm going to do is just take it and Rub some on. Oh, that. Just a little bit. Dab around. Now, whenever you do these filters. These gaskets that are on it, uh, don't try to go light on them. There's nothing wrong with going a little heavier on the gasket, especially on the inside lip, because that's what's going to mate up with the surface. So usually you have plenty of oil, especially from oil changes. Where you've done an old oil change, it's, it's not too dirty. It gets rag. I'm gonna wipe the outside of this thing off. Now, I don't know when this thing was done last. Um, I bought this skid steer used when my father did, and then he never used it, so. Uh, I pretty much got it from him, so it didn't just sit and rot. So let's get back in here. I'll go over in this area here and drop my hand down. It fits that way. I'll try to go the other way. It doesn't really fit. So I'm going to the left. Make sure it's turned up on there good. Okay, I'm left. Yep. again there we go now of course the manual recommends putting it on hand tight and of course you can see the number on the filter right there that is the oil filter number um, I'm looking up the manual Let's take this one. I'm gonna put this one over here too. Ooh, look at that. Jeez, that is terrible. Look at that. That is absolutely awful. Wow. Like I said, uh, I got this from my father. I don't know. He even mentioned that he didn't know when the last time this had been changed. So, there you go. Now, obviously, you want to go hand tight, but I can't get both hands on that thing because of using one hand. So, it's okay to use a filter wrench as long as you don't torque it down. You really just want to go in there 
And if you've done enough back here, you just kind of like with a wrench, regular wrench, a socket or something, just till it snugs up. That's all you want to do. So there you go, oil filter, 90 XT, 2001 case. Uh, changed, and as you see, it needed it pretty bad. That oil is black, black. That is not good. Um, it was way past middle. All right, I'll uh, be back again here soon for the next one. We're going to keep on changing filters and keep servicing this thing. I actually ordered kits. Uh, let's show you real quick before we hop off here. Let's turn that up. I actually ordered a kit. Uh, I found this leaking the other day, of course. This right here is leaking. So I've ordered a kit offline. So I'm going to pull this and then replace um, here and here all the seals. So I ordered it for both sides. I got it for this one, this one on both sides. I'm just going to build them all. You know, if you're building one, uh, this thing's older, I'd say they're probably all do. All right, that's it for today. Thank y'all. Um, if y'all have any comments, comment below. Um, any questions, uh, things about the service manual, uh, just let me know. Uh, obviously, okay, real quick to get back to the oil. Forgot about this right here, your dipstick. And then right there is where you put your engine oil, the filler. All right. So, dipstick, filler, and filter. All right. Y'all have a good one. Peace.